back to my channel. Thank you for watching. Today I wanted to share with you guys what is in my Happy Planner Planner Bay. Um, this nifty little thing has all of my journaling supplies and my planning supplies. And it has two compartments. It holds everything that I need and I can take it anywhere, which is really awesome. I am actually traveling today. Well, I'm staying in town, but I'm going to be um, leaving for the night to go on a pastor's wives retreat, which I'm super excited for. And I am able to bring all of my planning supplies so I don't feel deprived. I know to some of you guys that may sound a little bit funny, but if you're into planning and you're a planner girl, you kind of know what I mean. So um, this is my journal and then this is my planner that I use. Um, so I will be taking those as well. Inside my journal is also kind of my war binder and my sermon notes. So anyway, back to the bag, it has two compartments. So in the first side, I have a zipper pouch right here. And it just holds a lot of the stuff that I will have for my planner. It has extra dashboard cards. It has some, um, I'm a hot mess, like always, but it has some Target um, planner pouches. It has some stickers and some vellum and then also some of the Foxy Fix dashboards that I can kind of, kind of play around with. So I kind of have extra stuff in here for when I want to change my planner. Then I also have the tape runner, which is awesome if you have um, removable tape. It's super cool to just kind of add embellishments and then you can move them around in your planner. Here are some of my favorite fall clips. I'm, I will link down the shops below right now. Um, I'm not able to tell you where they're from. Um, and then some Ollie clips down here. And I just have them clipped to the side um, of, the, of the pouch right there. This sticker book is from Walmart. So Walmart is actually coming out with some amazing stickers. This is obviously faith-based, um, but it also kind of has, you know, little, um, I like these squares to kind of just prompt you for your journal pages. And it just kind of has some cute little stickers and some word stickers. Um, I'm really going to have fun with it this weekend as I'm taking notes on the guest speaker and um, just things that are in my heart and I can decorate the pages. I have some tea back here. Um, like I said, I travel with my, at my parents' house. Sometimes I would like some tea. So over here in this zipper pouch are all of my stickers um, and more embellishments. Here are some, um, I think, I'm not sure where these are from. Uh, but they're super cute. I usually have this all laid out um, on my bed or on the couch when I'm planning, but it just has tons of stuff. Here's some more sticky notes, um, some cute little embellishments for my journal. I made myself some uh, essential oil stickers. You guys know I love my oils. And just pictures that I've printed, all sorts of things. Um, as we're getting into the holidays, here's this cute little die cut and more stickers. These are from Sunshine Sticker Co. Super cute um, Halloween that I'm actually going to be using, I think, next week or the week of Halloween. And then here's some Planning Made Perfect, some more stickers I made. Um, so just a plethora of random stickers. Um, Here's some from Chaotic Blessing, and I'll link all of these shops down below. I'll go through kind of like what I've showed in the video and make sure that I link the shops down below. Um, like I said, just lots and lots of stickers and embellishments. Um, I like to be surrounded by them when I'm planning to get inspiration. So that's in that pouch. And then when you come over to the other side, there is more. So over here, I am not a big washi user. Um, I got rid of tons of my washi just to downsize. And most of this is um, kind of like that bohemian theme, uh, gold, gold theme. And then I have my cute little fall sample washi. And then in this pouch, I love how these come off, so you can kind of just take them and take what you need. Um, these are all my Tombow markers that I use for my journaling. And then I have some glue. I have my um, watercolor pen, which is super cute. 
So just random stuff in there. This um, is one of Planning Made Perfect um, Paisley designs, and I can't remember who made the clip, so I'll have to go back and research, but I'll link that below too. I think she still does custom. Then in here I have um, watercolor pencils, which are super fun, and I'm super not talented with them yet, um, but it's really fun to play around with. So I have those in there, and then I have a hole punch um, for my planning pages, some scissors, and then these are the Jane Davenport watercolors, which I love. Of course, it's going to give me trouble. There we go which I love and I use all the time, but it's super hard to keep these little things inside. So if you guys have any ideas on how to keep them there, I have um, a paper towel in here just to kind of keep it um, separated, but these, these still move around. I'm not sure if that's just what they do. Uh, kind of bothers me, but look how pretty this looks. I think I feel like an artist when I look at this palette and I never wash it off. I just kind of reuse the colors. So that's in there. And I think that's pretty much it, you guys. Uh, this was a really quick video, but this is kind of everything that I use to plan um, and journal. If you guys would like to see um, a little bit more of my journal, this is a Foxy Fix uh, Rowena, and it has a engraved embossed T on there. You can see it. Um, but this is kind of like my war binder slash journal. Um, I want to really get back into journaling again, and then I have some charms down here. Um, but yeah, that was it. I love having everything in one spot. If you guys enjoyed this video, please hit the like and subscribe button. I am going to be hopefully giving you guys uh, two videos a week as far as planning goes, and I have some other things up my sleeve. So stick around to hang out with me and I appreciate all of you guys being here and I will talk to you later. Bye.